Now, classic Athena posters that adored our walls decades ago are making a comeback. Anyone remember the tennis girl scratching a bum? The naked man cradling the baby? Yeah, yeah. do you remember those? Yeah. He was nice, wasn't he? Yeah. <laughs> well, all those posters are reappearing in our shops due to a high demand for the iconic 80s prints. So, girls, were, were those up on your walls? And if they weren't, who was? Well, I know it sounds a bit... It sounds a bit dodgy, this now, but... I actually had my other half on my wall <gasps> when I was a teenager. Because there was a band called uh, Liquid Gold. No, That's it. it. <laughs> oh, 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 is which one, one is he? The one on the very right with the long hair. Is That's, that Mr. Has he got a top That's on? Mr. Ed. Has he got a top on there, Jay? He's fit as a butcher's dog, isn't no, he? <laughs> There. No, he's got a T-shirt on. But um, I, uh, I had his poster on my wall when I was a teenager because I was mad on a song called "Dance Yourself Dizzy," mm. and I loved it. Yeah. And do you is, remember is that, that song? It? I yeah. 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 And it was is that it liquid was gold. Liquid yeah. gold. Yeah. No. Yes. Oh, I know. I know that. You I know. see, everyone's got a bit of gold in them, eh? I know. So I, and then when I met him, I was like, <laughs> stop it. <laughs> Do you know what? She's shocking, isn't she? Shocking the blush. So, yeah. I've so, got... when you started going out with him, yeah. was, did you leave the poster up there or did you no, sneakily take it down? down? I left yeah. David Essex instead, you know. Yeah. Right, 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 same pin good. marks. But... It might be David Essex next then. Oh, stop it. No. Right. No, I'm happy with me, Uncle Ed. Oh. Uncle Ed. from top to bottom with Wham posters. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. And Adam Ant posters. And I've got... Oh, look at him. Oh! If no. I only, just when he had hair like Lady Diana, there was just... Those white teeth. I know. And I've got another confession to make. <clears throat> I was... I don't know how old I was, probably about 12 or 13, but I, um, I couldn't go to bed unless I tongued George Michael's <laughs> I used to, I used to tongue the wall. How desperate are you? <laughs> I taught myself to kiss on the George Michael poster. Did you really? I know, so George, I know, you, if, if you are watching, I'm very sorry. <laughs> no, I think posters are a great, they're a great indicator of age, aren't they? Because mm. when you say wham, I'm thinking, God, I was so over posters by wham. <laughs> do, you, do you know what I mean? Because poster, poster time is like, for me, probably even pre-teens. You know, I liked yeah. Don Yosmond and I liked David Bowie, but I never had posters up on the wall when I was younger. Now, this is interesting because um, I used to have little posters in the cupboard. I used to keep them in the cupboard because I couldn't put them on the wall because wallpaper's all peeling off. And every time, <laughs> every time you put them up on the wall, you, they could just go, shh, and they'd fall oh, off because they get a bit damp. Shame. So I used to keep them in the cupboard, and I, there wasn't enough space because there was three in our room. And I had this poster, and I was obsessed with these two boys called the Williams Twins. Now. I've spoken to loads of... There, there they are. There they are. Who are they? And, well, they were Andy Williams, I don't know, grandsons or, or nephews or something. I, I don't know. I can't remember where, where they came from. Don't but look clean. They do. <laughs> and, I remember, and I kept asking people, do you remember the Williams twins? And nobody would, and I thought I was imagining it, and now we've actually found a picture there of them. So that's who I was obsessed with when I was uh, just coming into my teens, I think. But you're old now, love. Oh, I bet they are. I wonder oh. what they look like now. Where That'd are they good. now? Yeah, email us if you know. Um, <laughs> no, it'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Um, do you know the Athena posters, that big phenomenon thing? Yeah. Uh, well, we used to go into Athena all the time because, you know, having a black and white poster on your wall made you feel grown up and arty, didn't and it? cool. Yeah, well, then my best friend Claire and I ended up... Be to make cash when we were students, some photographer went, can I take a couple of photos of you? Now, Claire was beautiful. Oh, all long nice. legs yeah. and long hair, beautiful ringlet curls. And uh, so we did it for 50 quid, as you do. It's, that's a lot of beer when you're a student. Yeah. And, bizarrely, <laughs> both of us ended up as Athena poster girls. Can you believe it? Oh. So it was you then? No, well, I was on this postcard. I can't say I was a poster girl. I, was n I never got past a postcard. And mine only ever came out on Valentine's Day. It was me in some show home reading a love letter. But look, here's Claire. Do you remember this one? That's my best mate, Claire. Oh, <laughs> is it? That's her being well, scooped by a GI. She's definitely missed that train. <laughs> <laughs> definitely missed that oh, train. Safety, that's oh. not allowed. But yeah, so there you go. Oh. Who'd have thought it, eh? 50 quid, that's all we got for that. Oh. I know I'm banging on about it, but no, feeling but slightly conned. God. Anyway. <laughs>